All right, so setting up the gradebook to show strands. We're going to go into the math class here. And then we're going to go into the gradebook. And here we've already set up some assignments using strands as the grade schema. To make sure that we only have that as an option, we're going to go into gradebook setup. And we want to make sure that restrict schemas to strands is checked. This way, when we set up assignments, those are the only options so that when we set up our columns, those are the only options that are seen in the gradebook. So we can set up the columns for the needed strands. We're going to do average. We can show as percent or letter grade, depending on what grade level we're wanting. Choose to show to students or not. Measurement average shows percent. And say these are the only three strands I need for this class. save. I go back to my grade book and here are the strands. Now we have all the strands showing in the assignment. We can simply go edit that and we're only using number sense, measurement, and pattern. So here is where we would change the weighting. We don't want to use a particular strand we simply change the weighting for whatever we need to have to make 100. You can space these out equally. Save. And then that particular assignment is only going to ask for those number, measure, pattern, number, measure, pattern. So any future assignments that are set up with strands. As you add an assignment, you select that schema where it's strands or strand letter grade, and then you set the weighting for the strands that you need. Hope that helps.